This is Prince's Road, Ashford. This is a four stroke, five bed, halls adjoining, semi-detached character home built in the late 1800s. You can see here it's been cleverly extended by the current owners, not only to the side, but you'll see across the ground floor to the back as we enter the property. But at the front here, you have an off-street parking space, and then there is a motor on the garage door there for access directly into the garage. Beautiful character home in this well-regarded residential road, which offers short proximity to the amenities of Ashford High Street and importantly, the mainline station. Let's take you inside for a look around. Spacious entrance hallway here as you enter. And then immediately on the left hand side, you have the main front sitting room into the bay. Quite adaptable this room. You'll see from the photos that actually the sofas are arranged slightly different. We have fireplace there, coal fireplace. Nice central chimney breast, which is a sort of real focal point to the room. But lovely and bright room across the front of the house. Quite a nice space perhaps for the children if they want their own sort of separate living area. As you'll see as we move across the ground floor here. Beautiful extended open planned kitchen dining living area. This would have been where the original dining room would have been so it keeps its place there. You have this fantastic accommodation across the back. Lovely high ceilings. Skylights pouring lots of light in here. Beautiful work surfaces, lots of kitchen areas, cupboard, space for American style fridge freezer, induction, nef hob there. Really stunning room. We have the bifold doors to the left and your French doors here on the right hand side. Let's give you a look back across this room. The measurement from the back of the dining room there up to where I'm standing is about 35 foot from memory. It's a lovely depth of this room, great space for entertaining. You'll see that we have a separate staircase there, which I'll come to in a moment. I'll take you out to the garden while we're here. Beautiful patio area, lovely well manicured lawn. We do have outside power points as well. And then we have a cabin at the back here, so there's power and light in here. Great space if you want to work from home, perhaps a little gym area. Storage, you can see it's all set up. We've got Sky out here currently. Really nice space to come away from the house if you did want a separate work from home space. Or a great space for the kids, or just storage nonetheless, but lovely room at the back of the garden. Looking back at the stunning house. Really tastefully done by the current owners. Thought of everything here, as you'll see as we continue to move through the ground floor. Here's a separate utility area, which leads out to the garden. The sink basin, washing machine and tumble dryer and dishwasher there. Ground floor cloakroom. And then just beyond the door there is the garage. And now up here, we have office stroke, fifth bedroom. So it's got a little storage cupboard at the cross the top of the stairs there. And then great office space with its own little loft hatch. And as I say, bedroom number five. We'll have a look at the accommodation now up on the first and the top floor. So we have three bedrooms on this floor, the main bathroom, an ensuite to the front bedroom. This is the smallest of the rooms up on the first floor here. As you can see, just slightly under a double bed, but really good side kids room. Fitted wardrobes there. We're looking out across the back garden. As we move down the hallway, modern fitted bathroom suite. Heated towel rail, 
power shell positioned above the bath. <clears throat> nice double bedroom here. Again, looking out to the rear garden, so you've got some nice light pouring in. Comfortable double bedroom. Two girls here that share, so it works perfectly well to have a bunk bed in here. But nonetheless, this is a comfortable double bedroom. And then what would have been the original master bedroom to the front. Again, we've got the benefit of having the bay there. Wardrobe space along this wall here. And as we come back around, you'll see there's further space for bedroom furnishings. And then this bedroom has its own ensuite shower room, shower cubicle there. Really quite spacious, real bright and airy feel to this house. So you've not got many lights, there's a lot of natural light pouring in. And then up to the top floor, the reef storage cupboard there. Lovely big double bedroom. Views out across the adjoining rows of Ashford. Nice spacious room here. You must got space, chest of drawers, wardrobes, you know, freestanding curtain rail racks. <clears throat> and then tucked away in the corner here. Beautiful one suite shower room again. With a little Velux window in there. The beautiful carrot house right in the heart of central Ashford. Fantastic property. Beautiful, stunning kitchen. Please contact us on the Ashford branch to arrange a viewing.